Hey guys, it's me, Master 627 and today I am back on Lego's Island. Now, first off, you might ask, Lego, you said that Lego's Island episodes would be every single two days. Well, meant to say every two days, not every single two days. Okay, seriously. The answer to that is yes, they are every two days. However, the reason why I'm doing one today on Saturday, November 3rd, by the way, also apologies that I've not uploaded like the whole day. I was doing a lot of um, busy things today in real life. So yeah, um, finally got some free time to um, record some videos and this is the first one you're seeing today. One other thing you'll be seeing later is obviously Creativerse because it's Saturday. Um, and also Saturday Stories. Yes, I'm um, doing Saturday Stories today. I got a really cool idea that you guys will love. And yeah, it'll be really interesting today. So yeah, today it is Saturday, November 3rd, 2018. And there will be an episode of this tomorrow and then back to being every two days. The reason why I pulled up today is because there's actually some really cool updates I really need to show you. First off, if we go into the world, Obviously, I've accessed it today since obviously I had to take down Lego's Island Halloween, which I just did. Um, it is 7.05 p.m. right now. So yeah, um, I finished um, right at the time that you just saw, 6.08 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So yeah, um, I finished around there. And yeah. Um, let's just get into it, guys, because it's going to be really interesting today. Real interesting today. So, yep, told you, I'm correct. I was correct. Um, Lego's Island Halloween is gone. As you can see, there's obviously no more Halloween decorations. Everything is gone. And, oh my god, it was not as laggy as this before. Okay, yeah, that's better. But, um... The first thing you might notice is, first off, this says, Discover the Temple. Come back November 17th. And that is two weeks from today, since today is November 3rd. Where is that zombie coming from? But, um, yeah, the, the next one says, The Island Needs You. Come back November 17th. At the bottom of all of these, it says, Come back November 17th. Oh, hey, that's where that guy's come from. Let me kill it. <laughs> the lag actually makes everything perfect. So yeah, obviously, as you can see, the cave is back to normal. No more slime, no more nothing. And then it says, save the island. Come back November 17th. Again, at the bottom, all of these say, come back November 17th. The reason why I head down to the event room is, wait, oh. <laughs> Let me actually kill him. Ah. Please tell me I got some of his armor. No, I didn't get any of his armor. Rip. But, uh, yep, Lego's on Halloween 2018. It's officially over us today. And here it is. This says Island Expedition slash Camp Island. Now, yep, that is next. It starts on November 17th and ends on December 1st. Then after that, we must wait five days for the Christmas party. As that is coming after. So, yep. Uh, these things are all over, all over the island, the little notice things, you know, these things right here, the, these are all over the island, and yeah, yep, check it out, everything's gone, really cool, it's kind of sad actually, because I didn't actually get to last a month, it was so close to lasting a month, but no, fortunately I had to take it down today, because it was, um, already time. Yeah, it was already time to take it down anyway. Oh, come on! <gasps> come on! Come on! Why does it have to do it to me? So this says, The jungle is coming. Come back November 17th. Obviously, because there's a jungle coming. So yep, the lodge is back to normal. It no longer says Haunted Lodge. It finally goes back to saying Lego's Island Lodge. And if we head inside, there's actually two new chests. One right here, which is filled with all this junk. It's left over from the Halloween party, so yeah. Um, it also has all this junk, including the 200 subscriber hat. Which I'm actually going to probably go replace uh, in a different location. Yep. Back to normal, obviously. Yep, everything's normal again. 
Oh, um, um, I also decorated this for the Halloween party, but obviously it's gone now. Um, obviously due to the fact that it's, you know, not Halloween anymore. I don't know if I actually ever showed you that in the Legos Island Halloween, um, episode of Legos Island. You know, when I showcased it, um, at first. I think I probably forgot to showcase that, and if I did, then apologies. If I did, then okay, then. See, so, yep, theme park, everything's back to normal. I'm showcasing what things are back to normal. Well, everything's back to normal. And yep, the resort is still here, obviously, because that's obviously permanent. Because whatever I build on this island, it is permanent. It's free time. You get it? <laughs> no, uh. It's free time. There's nothing in these chests. That's kind of freaking sad. Well, uh, oh my god, yeah, the lag is insane. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, my light just went off. Okay. Um, yep, theme park is back to normal. Obviously, no more cobwebs. It was fun while it lasted with the Halloween party, I must admit. Oh, and check it out. Brand new prizes just for, um... Just for um, the month of November, because on um, December 6th, these are going to be changed. Um, I'm actually going to change this real quick. Hold on, I need to get an all cap. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yep. Available until December 6th. So you got until December 6th to get all these prizes. Uh, I'm actually going to do the rest of these real quick. I just need to update these real quick. I forgot to do it in advance. Um, when I was doing this, let's do the horn, coral, block, uh, what else? Let's do, um, we're gonna use, we're gonna bring on a minecart. So why the heck not? Uh, yep. Uh, let's also bring in Elytra. Perfect! Yep, Elytra will do it. And let me get rid of all this. And yeah, that's all the prizes, guys, for November 2018. So every month after any events, um, prizes get updated. So yep, again, everything's gone. Yep, um, hold on, let me check. Did I miss anything? Nope, I didn't miss anything. I'm, I'm just checking real quick just to see if I missed anything while taking everything down. And we will get back to the base, the, um, <laughs> not the base, the base, eventually. Sorry about that, but yeah. Um, yep, everything is back to normal. Oh, and there's another one right here. So this says, explorers needed, come back November 17th. So yep, everything fully back to normal. Um, there's also, um, another, um, stone thing. I'm gonna show you that right now. I forgot to show you guys that. Um, this says, beware the vines. Come back November 17th. Alright, the next one is over here. Um, right here. Uh, let me dig that out. And it says, the island is in danger. Come back November 17th. And that is true, the island is actually kind of getting in danger. Because obviously, you know, this whole event and stuff is coming soon. So it says, beware the temple traps. Come back November 17th. So yeah, I put a lot of preparation coming soon. Um, next Saturday on the 10th. Um... <gasps> no way! <laughs> Look! <laughs> One of the dogs are stuck in the minecart. Like, how the heck did this dog and this minecart get down here? That's so funny. That's actually kind of funny. I actually 
That actually makes me laugh right there. That's actually cool. And there you go. That snows. So, yep, everything is fully normal again. As, uh, as always. So, yep, no more Halloween stuff. It is completely normal the way it is. Uh, let's see if I can get the guy in here. Okay, he's good enough. Probably should feed all these guys, but yeah. Yep, everything fully normal. Back again. Alright, now let's head back down to the un underground. Oh, wait, I actually forgot to add the torches back to these. Ah, <laughs> oh, rip. I forgot to add the torches back to these. Um, these rooms. Oh, yeah, I actually did forget to add the torches back to these. Back to these rooms. So, yeah, there we go. That's one thing I missed um, while doing this. But yeah, here it is. Here's the room. Obviously, the little slime puddle is gone. Because obviously, that was only for Halloween. Well, the whole floor was slime. And obviously, this floor was slime too. On um, this one. Everything was slime. But yeah. Um, oh, I, I already went up there. I also um, redid these. So yeah, this is back to normal. Uh, this is back to normal. This is back to normal. I don't really go into those chests at all. Um, I have them for obvious reasons. Just because I want to feed the dogs there. Oh, I also forgot to showcase this. The jungle controls the island. Come back November 17. So basically, during this event, again, as I explained in yesterday's episode on November 2nd, um, the island expedition... Uh, which is more known as the Jungle Expedition. I might actually go rename it. Because... Now, it's really more about the jungle. Um, I'm gonna kill these guys real quick. But, yeah, as you can see, um... These rooms are, um, back to normal, obviously. No more Halloween stuff, because obviously, you don't see any cobwebs anymore. And jack-o'-lanterns, so obviously it's gone. Um, oh wait, there's another one over here. This is actually the last one, so it says. The village turns into a jungle village. Come back November 17th. That's the last one. Alright, let's head, um, let's head into the first building. Obviously the coffee shop. And I put it right next year. Um, uh, oh hey, the manager actually isn't in here. Let me, um, get that guy real quick. Because he wasn't even in here the whole Halloween party. Which was actually quite weird. And wow, that was easy. <laughs> There they got the one I wanted. Let's go into the library. But yeah, the coffee shop is back to normal. Um, actually, why not? We just put all villagers in here. Oh, and yeah, let me just get all these guys in here. Uh, shoot them down. Uh... Uh, nope, need a librarian. <laughs> All right, and there we go. Perfect. We also need some iron gobs, so obviously these guys don't get attacked again, because all the time when I come back here after maybe like a few minutes, all the villagers are dead. Obviously, because of zombies. Let me shoot this guy down real quick, because that's not the one we need. We need more of this. Yep, the hotel is obviously back to normal. It actually took me the longest to actually take down and put back to normal. Because the whole rooms were like completely empty. Come on, that's not the one we want. Shoot the guy down. No, oh, come on. <sighs> there we go. But yeah, um, the hotel is fully back to normal. No more hauntings, because obviously Halloween is gone. 
And I'll prove to you that these rooms are actually all back to normal. Check it out. The first room. Yep. See, look. Everything's normal again. No more Halloween stuff. The hotel isn't haunted anymore. Everything's normal. It's just... Everything's great. So, yeah. All the rooms are normal again. Which, again, is really cool. Actually, I need to add a torch. That's what we needed all along. And I actually forgot to add torches to the hallways the whole time. And, yep. Up here, obviously normal. And, yeah. I'm actually going to add a torch right there. Uh, you know what? Why not? For all means, let's just add a torch to um, every single one of these rooms in case they actually are dark. And this room is dark indeed, so we're going to add a torch. And this room already has a torch, so we don't need it. I already put the torch in the third room on every single floor. But yeah, every single room is uh, normal again. Everything is normal. Just, again, just plain old normal. It is sad that these rooms are normal again, and just not the haunted rooms. Um, but this hotel is getting decorated for Christmas. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I'm always decorating the hotel for Christmas. Well, technically, this hotel wasn't even here last year. So, um, it's going to be the first time I decorated it for Christmas. It was also the first time I decorated it for Halloween. Obviously, because the hotel wasn't even here last Halloween. And you never even saw the Halloween party. One more floor to go. Yep, 6-4. Um, this one actually took the longest to actually take down because of the railroad. Oh, hey. <laughs> There's two skeletons in here. Oh, yeah. And shoot this guy down. Uh, is there a skeleton in here? Nope. How did these guys get in here? It's completely lighted up. All right, here we go. And, oh wait, we need to add lights into here because it's actually dark. And I actually never did that to any more of these rooms. <laughs> Head back down. And we're also going to start working on the campsite. Um, we're going to get to that in just a second, um, the campsite. I'm checking real quick. Did I miss any rooms? Nope. I am completely correct. So yeah. Uh, oh wait. In the roof. I also forgot to mention the roof. That's normal. Obviously. See look. No more cobwebs. No more mob fight. However. You may notice the chest is actually still here. And it's still filled with all this junk. Speaking of junk. Let's put it all in here. See yep. Everything is again normal. Um, until the 17th of November. I mean, the hotel is not going to get decorated till Christmas. So, the hotel is staying the same for the whole month of December. Well, of November. In a little of December. Oh, frick, the mob invasion has begun. Even though it isn't Halloween, the mob invasion still continues. <laughs> get out of here. <gasps> nice, an iron ingot. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed right now. And he died in the water. Nice. And that's why I need iron golems to um, keep all these villagers safe from the zombies real quick. Because, again, every single time I come back to the village after at least a minute, the villagers are gone. Obviously, because of the zombies. So I'm going to build four iron golems. Yep, I'm going to build four iron golems. Oh, wait, <laughs> that's not how we do it. Yep, there we go. That's how we do it. See, look, I know how to build these guys. These guys are cool. And one more um, over here. Wait, yeah, right here. Right here. One more. Done. Okay, so now that we got four iron golems for the village, um, we're done with the village. Oh, I also forgot to mention the clothes shop. It's obviously the first time that it's being normal with the clothes shop. So yeah, here's the um, the clothes shop, guys. Um, it's normal. 
for the first time. And check it out. We got the November 2018 catalog for the clothes shop in Lagos Island. Check it out. So it says, Legos Island Clothing Catalog, November 2018, Expedition and Camp Theme. So we got the Expedition Hat, the Expedition Jacket, the Temple Tracker, the Jungle Boots, the Camp Bag, the Matches, the Camp Scarf, and the Marshmallow Bag. So basically, these are half combined with both of the events that are coming this month. And technically, both of them are being combined into one party. So yeah. As, I, as you saw in the event room, both of these are being combined into one event. And now it's raining. Rip. But I probably should go put these away in a random chest. In case I even find one. Um, put this back. But yeah, it's cool that these rooms are normal again. It's the uh, first time for a lot of you that you've actually seen the island look like this because during the time you subscribed, it was still Legos Island Halloween. So basically, this is the first time you're seeing the island looking normal like this. So basically, this is what it looks like when it's normal, um, except for these. Yep, those, uh, the island looks exactly like this except for these being here. Other than that, the island is fully normal. But yeah. As I said before, we are going to start our progress on the campsite. So it says, campsite coming soon, aka November 17th. So, where we want to go is all the way down here. I'm going to start building a path, as that's what we need first in order to get to actually get down here. So, with that said, let's get into it. Alright! So first things first, in order to do so guys, uh, we need to build... A path and this is how we want it check it out an ordinary path <laughs> actually is that good enough for the path I feel like it's not. Is it good enough? I think it is good enough. Yeah, it's good enough. Yeah, let's just continue on. Uh, no. No, no, no. That's not what we want. No, no, that's not what we want. We want something better and more respective. So forget that. Well, technically it is going this way. I think we just need a different path. Yeah, we're gonna need a different path. So let's go with dead coral block. Uh, this looks cool. Uh, does that look cool for a good campsite? Um, Thing here because we are going to one in the next two weeks for Lagos Island and I want everything to be nice and smooth for when we go there yeah because we are having one in like two weeks two weeks time guys two weeks time we are going to um, have a campsite on Lagos Island I don't know how to make the path. It's directly angled. And the only thing I need to do is put all this stuff away. Oh! <laughs> That's right, because I'm wearing the, um, the pumpkin head. Yeah, I know how this looks. It looks cool. I probably should have worn this during Legos Out on Halloween. I mean, I know how it looks, obviously, when you put it on. Um, I just haven't done it in a long time. That's why. See, so yeah, the path to the campsite It's going to be quite obvious. Um, it's probably just going to be this path right here. Yeah, it's going to be this path. Sorry that I took so long trying to actually figure out what path I was going to use. Even though clearly I was going to use this path. 
but I just didn't know what I was just going to use at first, so, yeah. Here we go. We're going down to the campsite, guys. Oh, and yeah, by the way, there's the maze down there. Just giving you a heads up. In case you forgot, which not really many of you actually know about the maze. And that is completely understandable. So I know a lot of you don't even know, like, what the heck all this is. I'll even give an example if you guys don't even know, like, what the heck all that is. Um, basically, it is... Um, basically, it is um, a random maze that I built about a few months ago. Um, I actually built it 10 months ago in January of this year. So yeah, um, it was for a random event that I was going to hold called like Legos Island Underground Maze. And there's actual proof that I actually made the event in the event room. Now some of you that have been subscribed for a long time, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So yeah. But obviously, new subscribers don't even know like what the heck I'm even doing. But yeah, I am uh, building a campsite. Because obviously, I think there's something deserves to be down here. I mean, don't you think something deserves to be down here? Well, I think so too. I think that something definitely deserves to be down here. And why not get the better opportunity of building a campsite? So, I'm now building a campsite for the island. Um, so yeah, this is going to look cool once it's done. Um, right here is actually going to be probably the main base of the campsite right here. But I'm just building the path. And that's pretty much all I'm probably going to do. I'm not going to do any building other than making the path. For now at least. The path will be done. Well, the building will be done in a later video around tomorrow. So yeah, here we go. Um, oh, and you might also notice the wall. Um, I'm actually going to dig that out in just a second. Because obviously, I want to dig out the wall. Because it deserves to be dug out. See, I'm going to dig that out in just one um, second. Because obviously, more of the campsite is over here. So yeah, I expect all of this in the next two weeks. I mean, you're going to see my progress as the time goes on. Yep, as the time goes on, you will see my progress progress um, with me building this. So yeah, don't think I'm not doing anything because I am clearly doing this until I actually do it. So yeah, this is going to be a real long project. Um... That's the only bad part. How are we going to actually get down? Well, the simple way is by doing this. Actually, the simple way is by doing this. Which probably explains why I'm doing this in the first place. So yeah, basically, you gotta climb onto a mountain or in order to actually get down here to uh, the campsite. So yeah, basically, yeah, you gotta climb a mountain. Um, I don't think I'm actually gonna dig out the wall. I think I'm just gonna keep everything exactly the same, exactly the way it is. So yeah, sorry that I probably tricked you guys there, but I just felt like it for a random reason. Yeah, um, now that's gonna look like that, and now that's gonna look like that, and now that's, that's gonna look like that, and yeah, basically everything's just gonna look like this. So yeah, check it out, this is the, um, official, um, start area. Actually, we're going to keep that. We're going to keep that bush. However, the rest of the path still commences. Yeah, we're going to 
should keep all these. You know, I could just dig this out, honestly. Do I need it? No. However, right here, as the time goes on, more is going to be added. So, yep, I'm only adding, like, the path, and then we're done. I'll do more tomorrow. Uh, in the meantime... Oh, hey, nice. Something's down here, nice. Um, now nah, I'll worry about that soon. And, yeah, let's get rid of this. Yeah, this is basically where everything's gonna be, guys, for the whole campsite. Like, literally right here is where everything's gonna be. I mean, you still got everything else. It's coming soon throughout this whole project, which I'm still really excited to do. And it's just gonna be real cool what I'm going to do with this small little area over here in the middle, or in probably the middle of nowhere of Legos Island. I mean, technically, you can still see a lot of things from here. I mean, yeah, you can still see, you know, the you know the Blue Railroad or the Lapis Railroad that I built, obviously, over a year ago um, off camera because I wanted to surprise you guys with something last year. And I surprised you guys with the Lapis Railroad that none of you probably expected me to make. And that was um, a year ago on um, March 27th. And I just remember the fond memories of building that. But now, I'm building something under the railroad. Which is obviously this beautiful campsite. So yeah, again, this is basically where everything's going to be from now on. And uh, I will add stuff, obviously, to this path soon. Uh, what you're seeing right now is like a huge area that's going to be like full of like fun activities and a bunch of cool things just coming later on in the future so yeah don't expect any of this to die it's gonna be really fun once it's complete like i cannot wait to show you guys the full version um obviously being built throughout legos island episodes that's what's gonna be for the next few episodes is me building this campsite so yeah i'm just finishing off the path here and then i'm gonna um, end the video here because, um, yeah. Anyway, what else do we got? Do we got everything we need for the path? Well, technically we do. It's just not directly yet. It's because we actually have this cool little path right here, I guess. Um, yeah, we got a cool path. Um, it leads right here. And yeah, it's for this. Um, I'm actually going to take down some of these trees. I'm actually going to burn down some of these trees. Um, very soon. Because they don't need to be here anymore. And plus, they've been here for a year, so. You know what? Let's burn them down. Let's do this. burn down all these beautiful trees because this is our new campsite all these trees that you see right now are getting officially burned down for good and oh god I caused a lot of a lag So yeah, now we got enough room to build whatever we want. Excuse the lag, because obviously, um, fire and stuff. God. 
Oh my god. And yeah, here we are. We are now down at the official pond for the campsite. So that's going to be really cool to see what comes in the future for that. And wow, all these trees are burning down. Neat. So yeah, this is just like a little pond that we're going to use for the um, the campsite later on. So yeah, now we got a whole huge like version to use all this stuff. Boom. Now we got more room to use all this. So yep, the rest of this is being burned down. And the lag makes it even worse. The rain does. There we go. We are done. Oh, nice. We even got an apple. Oh, that came out of nowhere. I'm not going to worry about the mobs. There we go. But yeah, this is basically where our campsite's gonna be pretty much from now on. So yeah, this is basically again where everything's just gonna be. For like the whole campsite. And it's just really cool. So yeah, a lot of big things are coming in the next few weeks. So yeah, be on the lookout for all of this coming soon. It's just gonna look epic, guys. I just cannot wait to show you the rest of this. But yeah, um, we have officially done that. So yeah, that's actually it for this video, guys. I said before that it would be the end of the video after I'm done creating the path. And I am done creating the path. So yeah, we are um, officially done. And yeah, um, this is how far we got. Um, check it out. First off, look at the path display. It looks cool, doesn't it? Um, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna test the path to see how good I did. Yeah, I actually did really good. I'm impressed. I love my work. Yeah, this definitely did take a lot of time and effort to do out of me, as you probably never expect someone like me to build something like this. Oh my god, that tree is still on fire! Like, look at that. Um, but yeah, um, here's the final bits of the path. I'm gonna take that out. And then here we are. I don't care about the cows, cause yeah. And yeah, here we are. This is where everything's gonna be. So yeah, guys, that's it for this video. As I just said before, please remember to like and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Look forward to creative verse later. And then finally, Saturday Stories. All right, guys. Also, let me know below. Um, let me know um, what you guys think of the camp path so far. Oh, and one more thing. I'm also um, sorry to um, say this, but I am um, apologizing because I did not go to the Waddle Up in-game event today. Um, you may have noticed the whole time that you did not see me there. And the reason was... Because I was busy updating Legos Island and doing a lot of other things in real life. So I wasn't able to show up to the in-game event. Sorry that you didn't see me there. Um, in the next in-game event, whenever that comes, I'll try my best to be there next time. So yeah, um, again, apologies that you did not see me in today's in-game event in Waddle Up. Alright guys, goodbye! For real this time. <laughs>